So I was at an art lab event last night and wrote, I don't know, four or five poems, I think. And I didn't take photographs of any of them, so I don't have them. But I was inspired to write one today. And I wrote it on full-size sheets of paper. So it's a little long, but you see how it's got my little edge thing there. Um, anyway, I'm calling it Life Poem 714, since today is June 14th. And I don't know what else to call it. I've been a lot of places, and I've done a lot of things. I've never wanted to be basic. I just wanted to sing about the beauty in the world and the wonder in our hearts. And as things have unfurled, I've practiced many arts. I'm not always good at them. Some would say I'm not always good. I do a lot of things that I shouldn't, and I don't do what I should. For the most part, I'm a poet, an artist of words and ideas. I know I may not always show it, but the way that I'm trying to be is as a vessel that can be used. That's also an artist of life. And I'm no longer confused on how to alleviate strife. I just need to see what's needed and ask how what I've got fits in. And that cycle is repeated until I've got no more to give. But that day is not yet upon us. And I don't mean to brag, but I'm just trying to be honest. I got some pretty nice skills in my bag. Yet for anything I may have done. And in whatever I may do, I believe God has a begotten son, and he's living in me and you. And every other actor in this world stage we're given. It's important that we factor in a faith that's beyond heaven. and has nothing to do with eternal rewards or what lies beyond the hereafter. Until we're no longer moving towards, and we can just embrace the laughter. That comes when we realize that I am you, and you are also me. And the reason we are here is to turn that into we. I don't care if you're a Christian or if you actually follow Christ. I'm not asking for belief competition or to sanctify one way is right. You could also be a Hindu or Muslim or a Wiccan or a Buddhist. If you're grateful to whatever puts breath in your lungs, I'm not trying to refute it. But let us love beyond our symbols of God and let us love one another as well. Let us all make our lives works of art and the stories that we tell when we prophesy our new hereafter and the future we create. For what will be revealed in that chapter is written by what we do today. Have a good day.